we're going to look at the 2017 Cabernet Sauvignon. The Cabernet variety, Cabernet Sauvignon variety is used in Bordeaux. It's one of the prime varieties there. And when we first planted the vineyard here, we, we had a look at the climate and found that it was very similar to Bordeaux. So we, we thought we would be okay in growing 10 acres of Cabernet. This 2017 was a lighter year in volume, but uh, the wines were delicate, uh, but great intensity of flavor. Not, not uh, so big that they are too uh, stringent in the mouth, but quite a lot of delicacy. Uh, an ex a good example of Australian Cabernet. It's already four and a half years old, uh, and it's drinking beautifully. I suspect it will last for at least another 10 years. Um, we've had some good reviews on this wine, especially for value for money. And we're looking at the 94 point mark. That's just about a gold medal in the old standard, which is 18 and a half points. I would rate this as about 18 points. But when you look at the value for money, the, the a recommended retail at $14. This wine should earn an extra mark to get it over the uh, gold gold medal uh, level, so 18 and a half points. It's a, a wine that's got beautiful berries, cherry aroma, touch of wood in the background, not not dominant, very soft, very very integrated, and it will integrate more. As, as it uh, uh, matures in bottle for longer years. The, the palate is tight, long in flavour, still young. The wood is beautifully balanced with the middle flavour. Tannins are, are soft on the back palate um, and it just lingers, the aftertaste just lingers down the back of the throat so softly. It's a it's a wonderful wine to drink now, uh, with, with lots of dishes. Meats would obviously be the, the, the main one. Or just to have out here on a sunny day, uh, cheese, platter of cheese, and enjoy the, the ambience and the view of the vineyard. I think you will enjoy it.